Excellencies, ladies and gentlemen, it's a great honor, pleasure to be addressing you all in this important Africa-Saudi summit in this beautiful capital of the brotherly kingdom of Saudi Arabia. I want to express my gratitude to the government of the kingdom of Saudi Arabia for the warm welcome and hospitality afforded to me and my delegation. Additionally, I want to express my gratitude to the organizers from the African Union and the government of the kingdom of Saudi Arabia. From the offset, I would like to register the Somali government's concern with the ongoing situation in Gaza. We call on an immediate ceasefire and humanitarian access to assist the most vulnerable parts of the community. We also reiterate the importance of working towards the realization of the two-state solution at the earliest possible opportunity. Somalia and Saudi Arabia enjoy deep historical bonds for friendship and multifaceted cooperation that we seek to build on with the modern opportunities to spark common progress and prosperity. As a country, we are truly grateful to Saudi government and people for their vital contribution to our successful ongoing war against the international terrorism at home. We also recognize the key role Saudi Arabia played in supporting Somalia's successful economic reform efforts, political stability, and humanitarian response to multiple climate shocks, including the most recent droughts. As Somalia, we applaud the Saudi government led by the, the vision of His Majesty King Salman ibn Abdul Aziz al Saud the King of Saudi Arabia and the custodian of the two holy mosques, and His Highness Mohammed bin Salman, the Crown Prince and the Prime Minister of Saudi Arabia. On the evident economic success we are witnessing today, Saudi Arabia is successfully diversifying its economy, creating high-level jobs, investing in the long-term development of its citizens. In Somalia, we are working tirelessly to do the same, and as we are at the cusp of achieving debt relief, we are more confident than ever before that this can be achieved. Your Highness, Excellencies, ladies and gentlemen, Somalia's economic strategy is to grow through, through trade, investment, and strong and productive regional and international partnership. As you all know, Somalia is strategically located in the Horn of Africa with one of the longest costs, costs in the world, a young and entrepreneurial population and a strong digital penetration footprints and culture. Furthermore, our government is absolutely committed to advancing a private sector-led economic growth model which rewards investment and enterprise with the state providing clear and advantageous investment environment. Our message is crystal clear. Somalia is open for business. Somalia's resources are abundant and all major industries are untapped Going forward, we can truly be among one of the world's leaders in agriculture, livestock, green energy, telecommunications. Furthermore, investment in Somalia can genuinely address food security, ease the transition to green energy, and enhance Saudi Africa economic prosperity through transport and infrastructure facilities in our strategic location. The letter is even more unique to Somalia as we are members of the African continental free trade area and are aiming to achieve accession to both the East Africa community and the great Arab free trade area by the end of this year. I'm confident that this will create boundless opportunities for joint economic cooperation, growth and prosperity for all our people. Without doubt, Saudi Africa relations cannot succeed without a strong partnership between our respective private sectors. In this regard, we must explore every opportunity to encourage 
support and facilitate the entrepreneurial aspirations of our wealth creators, the young generation. Excellencies, ladies and gentlemen, in conclusion, it's a fundamental. We rise together to the existing global challenges, Saudi partnership. We in Somalia are firmly committed to this as Africans and broadly ally and a friendship of Saudi Arabia. I thank you all.